Let's go. You should always stay focused. Day three, day three, my fellow ballers and ballerists, what's up? We are at day three, still going strong. Well, strong, we'll still, we, we are walking on eggshells, but we still balling uh, until further notice. Um, so yeah, so uh, day three, guys, uh, I was blessed playing with uh, the Xeno Monster again. And the, the the great bad man Steve O. Uh, so uh, we talk ball real quick, guys. Um, you know, uh, to all the the the, the girl, boys and girls who wants to become shooters, um, this video is probably one of the best that I have uh, right now when it comes to shooting. Because I was playing with the Xeno Monster, so obviously I I strongly urge you to 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 watch his mechanics. Uh, on how he how he shoots all right um this is the 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 key to success if you want to become uh, a good shooter and then a great shooter eventually uh it's the little things guys the details the fundamentals right and if you watch how he he's doing his thing uh you, you'll see exactly what i'm talking about uh we're not talking about shooting the ball just to shoot the ball we're talking about shooting to drop the ball in the baskets we're talking about buckets and he's one of the best he's one of the best doing it so um so it's it's more like um when you watch the little things how he holds the ball where he's holding it uh, especially uh when the defender is in front of him with the hand in his face and everything uh, to me the way, when i see it is like he he trained that right that's something that he practiced um uh well when he's practicing because you can see the way he's positioning the ball versus the hand that's trying to the disrupting uh disrupt him and he's like rolling the ball and everything and when he pulls up uh he drops it right of course but it's just it's just how it's like he mentally visualized uh the hand he already did that before because to him it's it's no longer an issue it's no longer a problem it's not a stress for him to have a hand in his face or a hand who's trying to steal the ball because he's got he, he he find ways to position the ball away from the hand or close to the hand but the release the motion will always remain the same he doesn't change his shot because of the pressure and that's something that's super important if you want to become a shooter. It's never to change your shot. If you're a strong believer that your shot is a good shot, you don't change it. You don't change your release. Okay? You have to keep that in mind to become a good shooter. You never change your, your, your motion. You don't change your release. Because if you do that, you're going to miss your shot. And even under pressure, well, 90%, 99% of the time, you're going to miss the shot under pressure. And I guess you're going to see it. He got double team. He drops it anyway. But the release was the same. So nothing changed. So that's something that's super important for every uh, player who wants to become a shooter, especially now in this new era. Uh, it's all about shooting threes. You need to, 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 to get the fundamentals uh, perfectly in sync in what you want to do. Catch and shoot off the dribble. You know, you want to you want to you want to become the next Steph Curry. Then this is the little things that you need to to embrace uh, in your practice and your workouts. The dipping, you know, uh, the people I work with, they, they they still don't understand the 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 concept of the dipping. If you dip the ball down to your knees and then you bring it up, you you're wasting time. You're wasting time and you're giving time to the defender to come at you and block your shot. So normally where you catch it is where you shoot it. If the ball is right here, you catch it here, then you pull it up from here. You don't dip it down. I know it's a, it's it's it sounds crazy, but uh, this is the fastest way to shoot and the precise way to shoot. When you dip and then you bring it up, you have to adjust your hand on the ball, shoulders and everything. So you, you have to be ready, even off the dribble. When you, you stop your dribble, don't stop your dribble uh, below, uh, well, at, at your knees and then bring the ball up. You know, you stop your dribble. When you catch the ball, it's a dribble, you have to catch it right under your chin and above the waist. 
this is where you can have a quick a quick release and a precise one and this is the perfect way uh, Zeno is doing it so you're going to be able to watch that uh, second thing I was asked to, to answer a question I was asked um, my motivation my drive to, to keep doing what I'm doing and playing ball um, first of all first of all I, I love basketball that's the that's not that's not a secret and second of all uh, I love the concept of working out the training aspect of the game the the, the the fundamentals the little things just to improve yourself as a better basketball player and to me it's a never ending learning process I still consider myself as a student of the game I'm 41 years old guys going on 42 in November and to me there's a lot of things I still need to I still need to learn and I want to learn it because I feel I still have a lot of basketball in me uh, and keep going so to me it's just taking care of my body working out work my cardio as well uh, and all the little things man you sleep well you eat well and the rest will follow um, until the day I get up and my body says that's it I'm gonna keep playing I'm gonna keep playing and do what I do and if I feel I, I cannot contribute again on the on the floor, then that will be the, the the end of me on the floor. I will step aside and leave it to someone else. But until this day, ball is ball, shoot is shoot. I'm going to keep doing my thing. All right? So um, I'm going to roll the tape, guys. So in the meantime, do not forget to subscribe to the page to put your likes and comments, questions. I am here for you guys. We never stop the love. Uh, ball is life we are in the scorpion universe I'm gonna see you and I'm gonna roll the tape